Hey everyone, Cobra here. Welcome back to my channel. So for today, Soul Mask video, I have some big news for you. So I've spoken with the developers and I have some info about an upcoming update that's not actually out yet, but will be coming to you soon. So I'm going to give you a little bit of sneak peek of what to expect for that. <coughs> so the first things that they're really changing a lot are the teleportation. So the first one is self-built portals, you know, the ones that you get it from the ancient dungeons. Those will now, by default, allow tribesmen to teleport in them. So it won't be just you, it can also be tribesmen that can go through those. And that setting will be by default, it won't be something you have to actually change in the settings to have happen. Now the really big thing is every single holy ruin and every single ancient period, pyramid, sorry, will now have a cross-region portal. Now this is similar to the jungle portal, the wetlands portal, the volcano portal. Each of those five portals that already exist, there will now be a bunch more. In every single Holy Ruins, there will be one, every single pyramid, in addition to the ones that already are in the game. And the developers have said that, th that these are designed to reduce the travel time of people. They don't they know that it's uh, very tedious to have to run, you know, all the way across the map or even with a mount. And sometimes it takes 10, 15 or more like minutes to get to where you're trying to get to. And it's much easier if there's actually a portal. Like I know one thing that always was annoying is even with a mount, you know, in order to get to the ape boss fight, you have to teleport up to the wetlands portal. And then it's like a, you know, five to ten minute run up there probably about a five minute run if you have a mount otherwise you know 10 if you don't that was always a little annoying but now you're going to be able to teleport directly there now i believe that these will be just like the in-game portals where you actually have to find them and activate them before you're able to use them otherwise it would be a little too uh overpowered where people could just right off the bat teleport late game areas you know that would be a little crazy so i'm assuming it's going to be similar to what we already have now where you have to find it and activate it before you're able to use it more now in addition to these teleportation changes they've also added a few optimization things now these would apply for private servers and would also apply for single player um however i believe that on sorry on uh Official servers, this would not happen because these are all things that can be adjusted in the settings. Um, the first one is that the character backpack capacity can be changed. So you can toggle that setting to increase the capacity of the backpack that you have on your characters. Um, another one is campfires and portals. Also, the quantity limit can be changed. So if you want to be able to have more campfires and have more portals throughout the map, you can adjust that. Now these portals would be the self-built ones, not the ones that are actually already on the map. It doesn't add more random spots like that, it just allows you to build more. And the last one is morale consumption and building height limits. So morale consumption is essentially how fast you get tired. Uh, I know that a lot of people were having trouble in the desert or plateau area because it would increase the speed of that. And some people were saying it was exceedingly fast. That can now be changed on private and on offline or like friends, servers, just not on official because those settings are set already. And then building height limits as well. So that will allow you to then increase the amount that your buildings can go. Rather than having a set limit, you know, you can only build this many stories or this many walls up. That can be changed as well. So these are sort of a few things to look forward to. Some settings that can be changed. And then the really big ones are the portals where you can now take tribesmen through self-built portals. And a bunch more throughout the map to help ease your travel time. Um, I'm really excited for this update. It will hopefully be coming soon for us. I don't have a date for you yet. But stay tuned, I'm sure it'll be coming soon. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. Please like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more com content. If you have anything that you'd like to see in another video, also let me know down in the comments. I'm always happy to work with you guys on that, and I will see you next time.